Young Chicago man has dreams of going to college in Atlanta, but he's currently enroll enrolled at Tennessee State University. The only problem, he says he never enrolled in the school. This is Miranda Whittington joins us live in studio tonight with more on how this all happened. Miranda? Well, Bob, that's the big question. Now, Tristan Santion and his mother Jacinta are trying to figure that out. They say for the last two months they've been emailing and calling the school trying to get answers, and now they're afraid Tristan won't be able to attend his dream college this fall. Tennessee State University is a campus Jacinta and her son Tristan Santion have never stepped foot on. I, I promise you, other than pictures, I don't know what the campus looks like. But for some reason, her son has been enrolled here as a student even though he lives in Chicago. We never signed documentation. We never went to Tennessee State. He's never been to an orientation. He doesn't have an advisor. Jacinta and her son both graduated last spring with Jacinta obtaining her second degree and Tristan obtaining his high school diploma and associate's degree in IT. For me to see someone who's always had to be the strongest person for me, literally, it was just like, not so more like again, because this one was completely different from the others. Jacinta soon became very sick, so Tristan decided to take a gap year so he could care for her. A few months ago, he was ready to register as a student at Morehouse when they told him he was registered as a student at TSU. In my head, I guess the first question I had was, you guys need all this information prior to a student attending your school, yet somehow, some way, you just managed to put a random face to a name. Tristan and his mother say they've been calling and emailing TSU for the last two months, but nothing has been fixed. Inside, I'm just boiling because I feel like this can be something that can be easily resolved. And I feel like they don't care. His mother says he can't attend Morehouse until TSU unenrolls him. And right now, his spot at Morehouse and his scholarship are now in jeopardy. He deserves this. He does. And I'm crying because my hands are tied. And as a mom, I've gotten him this far. And I feel like somebody just yanked it from us. They say they've emailed the dean and even the president and will continue to keep pushing until something is done. I feel like you, you're creating a barrier for one of our children. Fix it. Now, we did call TSU about the problem. They told us they would look into it. And just a few minutes ago, I did speak to Jacinta, who told me TSU has contacted her and has officially unenrolled her son. Bob?